In this video, I'm going to be explaining how to complete a three digit subtraction using partitioning. Just like we did in the two digit video, we have to partition out the numbers. So, the first one we'll partition out is 625. So, 600, add 20, add 5. I'm going to be subtracting 314. 314. Next, we have to subtract the 314 away from the 625. So, 5 take away 4 is 1, 20 take away 10 is 10, and 600 take away 300 is 300. And we add all those together, and the answer is 311. In this second part of the video, I'll be explaining how to complete a three digit subtraction using partitioning when we have to borrow. So, first of all, we partition out the 524. So, 500 add 20 add 4, and then we subtract the 347. So subtract 300. Forty add seven. So once again we all start with the units, so four take away seven. So if I had four fingers and I tried to take away seven, that that would not be possible. So I have to borrow a ten from the tens. So there's two tens, which is twenty. We just borrow ten, put that into the units, and that now becomes ten. Now we can complete the units. So 14 take away 7, which is 7. Now we move on to the tens. 10 take away 14. So I had it was 10 people. I couldn't subtract 40 of them. So this time we have to move up to the hundreds. And we have to borrow 100 from 500. So the 100 goes to the 10, which becomes 110. And the 500 becomes 400. And then we can complete the tens. So 110 take away 40. Is 70 and 400 take away 300 is 100. And then we add them all up 177. 